The purpose of experiment 17A is to determine the number of water molecules in the chemical formula of a hydrate using thermal gravimetric analysis. To set up the instrument, first turn on the air and then nitrogen to maximum flow. Turn on the computer. There should be a beige pyrus bar at the top. If the bar is not there, select the pyrus manager. Turn on the instrument. The power switch is located above the plug on the back of the instrument. Click the Pyrus 1 TGA button at the top of the computer screen. The instrument is now set up and ready for you to fill in your sample information. The sample ID is the chemical formula of the hydrate under investigation. The operator ID is both partners' initials. Under the comment section, enter Experiment 17A and the day's date. Under the file name, fill out the experiment number, your initials, and the date. The next step is to fill out the temperature program for the experiment. Click on the program tab. Enter 35 degrees Celsius as the initial temperature. The final temperature for this experiment is 350 degrees Celsius. Put this temperature in the blank after 2. The heating rate for the experiment is 30 degrees Celsius per minute, and the seconds between points is 0.2 degrees Celsius. Set the go-to temperature at 3 degrees below your initial temperature. Enter 32 degrees Celsius. The next part of the process is to load the sample. Using the micro forceps, place the stirrup on the platform. Carefully put an empty pan into the stirrup. Do not squeeze the pan as it will lose its shape. Raise the platform so that the stirrup is just above the height of the balance hook. Push the stirrup and pan over the hook and lower the platform. Rotate the platform out of the way to the right hand side. Close the furnace by clicking on the raise furnace button. Make sure the stirrup is hanging freely and not clinging to the side of the furnace. Tear the pan by pressing the zero weight button. Open the furnace by clicking on the lower furnace button. Swing the platform to the left and raise it up so that the pan and stirrup lift off the balance hook. Push the stirrup and pan over the side of the platform. Remove the stirrup and pan and add 7 to 9 milligrams of sample to the pan using the analytical balance as a guide. If the mass is too small, you can add additional crystals. And if the mass is too large, you can remove crystals by tipping the sample pan and emptying the sample onto a Kim wipe. Return the pan and stirrup to the platform. Push the pan and stirrup so that the stirrup is over the balance hook and lower the platform. Swing the platform out of the way to the right hand side. Push the raise furnace button. Check to make sure the pan and the stirrup are swinging freely. Press the read weight button. Press the go to temperature button to reach the preset temperature. In this case, it is 32 degrees Celsius. When the temperature has been reached, press the start button. Move the cursor away from the button so that you do not accidentally click the mouse and stop the experiment. Slide the method page down so that you can see the progress of your run.